A friend is somebody who you hang out with. A friend is somebody who's like always there for you when you need them. It's been not been as easy, I think she thinks it has been, to just cut her out of my life. Normal friendships don't come with all the bull that comes of exes being friends. It's absolutely caused fights with me and my girlfriend, but it's not specifically personally about Veronica. It's just the insecurities of society. OK, well, society. I'm sorry you feel that way, really, Veronica. I get that you're still mad about it, but I mean, I don't have a time machine to go back. So what, what do you want resolution-wise out of uh, it? I want my friend back. I have always been there for you. I always thought that I would have you there for me. You've always said, like, we're ride or die. We have this marriage pact that if we don't get married by the time we're 50, like, we're going to get married. The marriage pact was Tim's idea. I merely agreed to it. Uh. And you're the one who keeps adjusting the age because you keep hitting the age. Okay. And now that I'm about to be 37, you're like, never mind. It's when we both turn 50. Yeah, but it, I mean, I didn't actually really think that we were going to be go, single. Yeah, I just never unmarried. thought that that would be a, a reality. But here we are. Yeah. I'm sorry. I still am your friend. I still care about you. I am your friend. Let's establish that. I didn't realize it was bothering you this badly. I appreciate that, Tim, and I hear you saying that you want to be my friend, but literally, I would like to see you acting like my friend, not just telling me you're, you're my friend. I never thought that I would be 37 and single. And even though it was like a bit jokey, there was that part of me that knew that by us making this marriage pact, that we would always be there for each other. But after everything that has happened, I don't know if this friendship can ever be what it was before.